All right, let's... Uh, I think we were doing the safe puzzle thing. Let's go. Oh, we've done it. Now we just have to, like, match it, I guess? Like that? Oh. Like that. Gilles Verne, the original notes. Damn, I have like no sound. Um. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it was true. What a treasure. Among other things. These documents contain the original blueprints for the Nautilus submarine. To think they nearly ended up in the wrong hands. They still could. I'm just saying. I know they're important, so you can take them. But please consider giving them back to the museum after the case. I mean, I hope, I hope we will. I should take them home and research further. I'll return them when this is resolved. Oh, okay, fine. We could have done this in the last episode, but cliffhanger, I guess. Heading home. It would seem Mr. Verne designed the Nautilus himself. Hmm. Good thing you found his original plans. Here's a list of Vermilion Watch members. I hope someone can help with this clue. Good, I look forward to seeing some of my friends again. Phileas Fogg. Fascinated by travel since childhood, Phileas Fogg performed a legendary feat when he circumnavigated the world in 80 days. His numerous experiences and adventures affected him deeply, making him worldly and resourceful. Desiring to put his skill to good use, he joined the Watch and has been on one of its cornerstones ever since. Then we have Edgar Price. Edgar Price is something of an enigmatic mystery. His shabby elegance suggests a gentleman fallen on hard times, and his mastery of natural sciences hints at an expensive education. With his mind perpetually set on his next ingenious invention, his social naivete led to his exploitation by the Red Queen. He has since seen the error of his ways. Feels like some Edgar Allan Poe here? Isabel Newton. Oh, I recognize her actually. One of the Watch's most valuable members, Isabel Newton, is a stellar engineer. Her expertise and ingenious inventions proved crucial in bringing down Irene Adler which is Sherlock Holmes. Miss Newton showed considerable courage and professionalism in the face of personal turmoil as the case put her companion, Henry Jekyll, in mortal peril. Jekyll was there. Okay, can I visit whoever I want? I feel like all of them. I want to like visit like the wrong person first, but I don't know if it matters. And maybe it doesn't matter at all. I mean, I guess this dude. I mean, ah, uh, well... I want- I want the right- wait a minute. What does the guide say? Does the guide say that it matters? Museum. Because I kind of presume it doesn't matter who you go to, right? Oh, we're in chapter 4 now, okay. Visit this mem- then visit- Oh, select Edgar Price. Okay. It might be that it doesn't matter, though. Okay, so let's do, I don't know, Isabel Newton, see what happens. I guess we can choose whoever. She is the foremost e physics expert in the world and has equipment to analyze anything. Okay, actually, let's, let's look at all of them. Master of inventions and all things mechanical. For some reason, I do not recognize him at all. And I guess he's still in the balloon? Yes. <laughs> a seasoned traveler and expert navigator, he knows his way around any map. I feel like he's not gonna be. I guess Edgar Price is the one we want to go to, but let's try Isabel Newton. I'm afraid I can't help you right now. Ah, okay, so there is actually a right answer. Alright, in that case, I want to just see what the wrong answers say. Yeah, it makes sense, though, that it is the inventor. There's nothing I can help you with, young Hawks. Oh, our name is Hawks? Awesome. All right, I mean, it makes sense with the... With the... Yeah. 
I know it's a bit messy here, but feel free to use my table if you need to figure out the blueprints. Why, thank you. Okay. Oh, that's what we're doing. Okay. Rotate and swap papers in order to form a complete image. Yes, okay, but like... No? Oh, maybe it's upside down. Maybe that's why it doesn't work. Stop. Yeah, okay. Oh my goodness, there are more. Okay. Ah! Um. Oh my good lord. Okay, I feel like this one is probably here. Like that. Yeah. Uh. Okay, that's better. Okay, yeah. There we go. The sheer size of the thing is impressive, but it also means there aren't many places for it to hide. Look for large underground chambers. Okay. Oh wait, there's a collectible here. Oh, they probably all have collectibles, don't they? This watch member has helped me out. Okay, so all of them are probably gonna help us one for each like chapter but I need to like not miss their collectibles okay there we go so where will your investigation take you um all right if I want to get better acquainted with the all's agenda henchmen I should probably get we should probably get acquainted with all's agenda more right I feel like that's Oh my god, my head. I feel like that's probably a, a good idea. Tread lightly. You don't want them to see you coming. Okay. Ahab's ship. We need to surprise Captain Nemo with a sneak attack. We already know their general movement pattern. They'll never see us coming. 
Oh. We'll set sail as soon as we load the supplies. They're planning to leave. I could sneak inside a crate. Oh, that sounds like a lovely idea. Why don't you do that? Who has claustrophobia? Not hawks. Ba ba ba. There's probably nothing else I can click here, right? No, okay. Just a comfortable. Alright. Oh, I have to. Alright. The rest of the team is off on their missions. So we have to be extra vigilant. Oh, I yeah, I guess he wasn't. Yeah, at the museum, it was it just a scarecrow there. There cannot be any distractions, especially from that meddlesome vermilion watch. If you catch him anywhere on the ship, throw him overboard. Nice. Oh hi. All right. The watch's treachery runs deep. It'll be difficult for them to regain my trust and get back in my good graces. I, I kind of don't care. Like, okay, good for you, dude. I should confront them only with good evidence of that henchman's involvement. But sure. Oh, a kunai. Kunai. Okay, I did see the collectible here. Alright. This mechanism is a bit rusted. I should keep as quiet as possible until the right moment, that is. Right. Quite a bit of oil spilling on the deck here. Oh, okay. There's something blinking down there. If only I could see what it is. Okay. Oh, I see now here. Right, right. Workshop. Ahab's quarters. <coughs> what did he drop in the storage bin? Glass dome. Okay. Which is different from the main deck. And then we have Lion's Room. There's no time to look for a key. The key. I must force this open. The segment is a bit loose. A series of badges seems to belong here. Every workshop needs a tough and sturdy melting pot. Let's go look at the glass dome. Ooh. Blimey, there's a huge observa observatory below decks. The Oz crew are full of surprises. This is super cool. Hello, steel pipe. All right. Another kunai. The six-pointed locking mechanism is quite unique. Clearly haven't been in many Hoppa games. Hydrogen gas, lighter than air, flammable as the sun. Super cool. Just hope it's safe. I should alert him to my presence. Alright, I guess basically we can't do anything in here. Which, I mean, makes sense. Yeah, no. Okay. I, I mean, I guess we can hit him in the head with a steel pipe. They're inside, better not draw attention before I can prove myself. I agree, but what do we do with this folding ruler? Oh. 
Ace of Spades. Um, there aren't even that many things here. Why am I not seeing anything? Okay, here we go. Aha. There we go. Oh, a thing. What? Oh, no. Oh, okay, that's why. You found tracking device. Hi. Need to get out of here. Need to catch him red handed. The mask can hide me. Really? I don't know, bruh. That's it. I should raise an alarm while he's occupied. Okay. What's going on here? Imposters! Explain yourselves. I should show them what I found. It would appear that Hawks found an intruder and stopped him from sabotaging the ship. I mean, I'm glad you're this, like, easily convinced, but, like, damn, dude. You're this easily convinced? Okay. <laughs> you only found one device. There are three more. Good luck finding them all in time. In time for what? In time for what? The Nautilus will track you down in no time. And here's a parting gift. Oh. Oh, another one of those. Lovely. The oh, dear. is making him hallucinate. He's becoming aggressive. Okay. I'll be safe here for a while. Find all the trackers and activate the ship's communications. I mean, he's good at telepathy. Cool. Um, I guess that means we can go into the lion's room. For real. Four identical items fit these groups. There's something tangled in the fur. It's stuck deep inside. Can it be fished out somehow? Well, yeah, with my folding ruler. No, oh, okay. I thought that was pretty good, but all right. Uh, something snaps into the center of the wheel. Oh, okay. Uh, sure what I can do with this. Oh, I can do something everywhere. Interesting. Oh. Alright. Good work. Now we can communicate throughout the ship. Cool. How does that help me? Oh, this is one of those. Okay, oh, hi. Okay. No, not what I wanted to do. Okay, oh, oh yeah, I've done it. Okay. <sighs> now then. What happens here? Tin Man is fixated on Ahab. Okay. Is 
seriously, what am I doing? Oh, oh. Alright. Okay. <laughs> Why? Oh wait, was something rusted? Before? Hold up. Oh my goodness. Oh, you know what? I'll figure that out next time because time is up. <laughs> ah! Okay, anyways. Thank you all very much for watching and I'll see ya!